My favorite part was actually going to the museum. Now I get to see the sculptures in real life instead of like in a book. There's a whole lot of things that you didn't see when you are just in a classroom. I learned how to use watercolors. I learned about printmaking. It's also cool to step out of my comfort zone with new mediums and different types of art. It made me want to do more art. The fastest and easiest thing to cut in a school is access to art making. And so allowing space for artistic expression in a school that has not had the opportunity to offer that to students, that's social justice. The mission of the Education Department at the Brooklyn Museum is to create a space that engages diverse visitors of all ages, backgrounds, identities. The Brooklyn Museum partners with schools in a variety of different ways. First, we look at schools as an entire ecosystem, looking at the big picture ways that the Department of Education operates, but all the while centering student experience. We're here to try to tailor to the school's curriculum needs and to their students' learning needs. And it's really important for our students, for our teachers, for the parents to see themselves in this space because through seeing themselves in the space, they're able to think about their own histories, affirming their identities, but also moving together to create a certain collective respect for one another. We want students to explore the arts and we want them to experiment with the arts through crafts and textures and materials. We started an after-school program titled the Art Ambassadors Program at MS267. We met twice a week. We did trips to different spaces of different types of art that exist in Brooklyn. Through my time with them, I was interested in just developing their field of knowledge of what art is. It's special largely because of the bridge between the museum and the school. The whole program is definitely a social justice act because art is consistently undervalued and just erased from programs. So Brooklyn Museum is really just challenging that and actually saying, like, this needs to exist. Just in seeing the artwork that they created, I mean, just like the level of expression, of detail, of color, and also like the subtlety of many of the topics that they chose, to me, it was incredibly powerful. It was a way of bringing art to our students and the community. It was a new adventure because we included the social justice aspect of the program, where their art would reflect what's going on in the world and what's important to them. To have our youngsters at this age to be able to look at social issues and be able to use the art to represent it and send messages is really extremely powerful and this is what the Brooklyn Museum has done for us. I hope that schools view us as a resource. We are partners with them in their goals to educate new minds and to deal with issues about history, ownership, personhood in our space in a safe way those young people to come through our doors become the creators, the historians, the artists of the future. I want to like go to high school for everything art. Maybe even college. I don't yes. Know. Make a living. Seeing all the things I've done, it makes me feel really proud of myself. <laughs>